Hey guys, Savage Jane here, and welcome back to another episode of Weaponology. And today we are doing the last shotgun I have to do. Thank God, it is a it's a USAS 12, and I really hate these full auto shotguns. Um, they just they I don't know. I don't like how their the first shot's accurate, but after that you're kind of fucked. Uh, if you do it, if you shoot it like that. You're okay, but if you do it the full auto, yeah, you're you're screwed if you want you know accuracy. And I don't really like, I don't really like when guns are like that. That's why I really didn't like any of the you know semi-auto snipers, uh, because most of them are like that too. So it's that's kind of a turn off for me when it comes to a gun. Uh, I like my guns to be accurate, you know, to a point where I can you know shoot pretty fast with it. And not my, and not like have to worry about not hitting anything, because um, this gun it seems like, you know, after, you know, two bullets, if you're holding it down on full auto, really the the bullets just go everywhere, and that, that's that's kind of the the whole opposite point of what you want in a gun. So you know, I, I'll never use these uh, semi-auto guns again. The only reason I ever used the USAS 12 in the first place was because uh, frag rounds on Op Metro just, you know, to piss people off. Because let's be honest, back when, you know, Battlefield 3 was brand new, a lot of people did that just to make people angry. Just, you know, throw a bunch of frag rounds all over the place and get kills just because you're shooting frags out of your fucking shotgun. But uh, I've never used it really since. Uh, just because I knew it was a bad gun, uh, I just, I don't know. I don't, I don't like anything like this. Uh, I, I did have slugs on it, so I, mean, I am kind of cheating. But it's it's kind of whatever. If you use slugs on it, it's, it's still, it's a pretty damn good shotgun. Uh, flechette and um, Buckshot, they're really only used for like clearing out a building. But slugs can be used for that too. So I don't really understand why you would ever put, you know, Buckshot or Flechette on your USAS 12 unless, you know, there was a rule against it in the server you were playing in or something. I don't know. But it's just slugs are such a good, uh, you know, such a good ammo type in shotguns. Obviously, they're, they're kind of overpowered a little bit. But DICE didn't want to fix them, so I'm guessing they're going to be like this uh, until Battlefield 4 comes out, and hopefully they fix it from Battlefield 4. If not, I'm going to be a little pissed off because I'm tired of seeing shotguns all the time. So that's just how I feel about shotguns. Uh, I, I will pull it out, you know, if my team's, like, just getting shit on on a small map just because I know I can do a lot of damage with it really fast. Uh, I'm one of those guys with the shotguns where I really don't miss uh, it's, it's just, it, it's not there to miss, like, with a 870 or a Spaz 12 with slugs in it, you know, I can do a lot of damage very fast, and I've actually used them in competitive when other teams have pulled them out, so, it's just, it's something that we have to deal with as Battlefield players, this overpoweredness of slugs, and, you know, some of the guns in the game, just because, uh, Battlefield has done, you know, fixing their game so we're just gonna have to deal with them and just hope that battlefield 4 is better just cross your fingers and hope and pray and uh you know do all that stuff i don't i really don't think it is uh but um whatever battlefield's battlefield it's a lot of fun to play even though it's like broken in so many ways so i'll probably buy it anyway um but yeah usas 12 i wouldn't use it ever again uh, just like I would never use the MK3A1 ever again. It's just, it's not my playstyle to have something that, you know, throws that much, you know, am ammunition downrange with such a low accuracy and such a low damage output. So, yeah, I wouldn't use it. I don't really suggest anyone use it just because it's not that good at all. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. I will see you guys tomorrow.